So I've been talking about when is the right moment or the optimum, not right, but the best moment to sink on your beetle initially. And I've, I've referred to it as the flow line. Now the reason I do that is because a lot of skiers and ski, ski teachers, ski schools and so forth refer to it as the fall line. Nobody likes falling and so I don't call it the fall line, I call it the flow line. It's not strictly correct, the strictly correct word is the slope line. But the reason I call it the flow line is because I can draw you a nice analogy, I can help you draw a picture in your head of when the moment is. The flow line, the way I use the word, is that moment where the ski is pointing straight down where, shall we say I tipped a bucket of red ink on the slope. Wherever the red ink would flow, I refer to that as the flow line and it's at that moment that's the best moment to go, oh, just that much and sink onto your beetle. So that's why I call it what I do. Have a look at this gear. The thing to watch out for is the way that it's Mother Earth who is pushing his skis around in an arc each way. He's not turning his skis, he's not turning his body. He is being pushed around in an arc by Mother Earth and the pressure from the snow. Isn't that remarkable? So it's not turn, straight line, turn. It's arc after arc after arc. Now he's sinking on the beetle now. Mm -hmm. Now, 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 yeah. now. Each time his ski is pointing straight down the slope, he'll be sinking onto the beetle. Now you can't see him do it, can you? If you no. didn't know what he was doing, no. you yeah. wouldn't learn much from that. <laughs>